Welcome to the House of R&R &R Records. My name is Rachel Stanley. I'm the CEO and president of the company. We have here soap, soap from WVOX radio station in New Rochelle, New York. He's one of the greatest entertainers there is out there. Whoa. And I'd like to introduce you to him. How are you? Well, thank you. Thank you for having me. Um, as a guest, I'm always welcome to be on the new show. I really appreciate you being here. And congratulations on your new single. Kind of sexy, ain't it? Oh, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I heard you sold 50,000 in three weeks. Some people say those things, sister. We pushing. You go, boy. We pushing men in the house. And the name of the song is? Crush. I got a crush on you. Oh, wow. It's still personal. <laughs> and are we going to hear a little bit of it later? Absolutely, sister. In fact, that's an enjoyment I like to bring to my people, sure. Okay, let, why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Well, as far as the height goes, sometimes people equate the height with the excellence, but there's a height out there, y'all ladies. Six foot seven. And I love the singing thing. The singing is a way to express some of my thoughts. There's a lot more of them if you get a chance to sit down and break bread. But the music is a way to get the message out. And it's a carefree way. Almost people can hear you when the music can drown drown out and the thought is still there that you have something to say. Okay, what actually started you in the entertainment business? Well, good question. So many different things. But um, one of them in particular, I had a chance to perform at my brother's wedding early. And I saw the response from that performance so it kind of got me in a Michael Jackson state of mind. Oh, a little something, something, huh? Well, I watch this. There ain't nothing wrong with that. And what was your biggest fear when you started in this? Business? And you know, it's funny. I, I I don't even operate off of fear. It's so, so much excitement. I saw my cousins one time out in um, the Bronx, Grand Concourse, and I saw some of the moves they were doing when we were in Mount Vernon, and this was early, early 80s, late 70s. I saw some of the things that we were doing, and um, and doing some of those things and seeing some of those things. Um, the pop locking, the moon walking, um, the difference in uh, the body movements and how they got so much attention. I said, I got to do that. And I actually started moonwalking with combat boots on. When and I could do it with combat boots back in 82, 83, 81, back in those areas when it used to be hot. Okay, so Michael kind of stole your style then. Well, no, nah, I ain't got you know, Mike is the ball. You know, I see where he learned a lot of that stuff from. And um, some major artists have influenced what I do. Stevie Wonder, Aretha Franklin, oh, W. Fresh. Right. You know, there's a lot, a lot of artists out there that tickle your fancy. And I can get a lot of love from a moment of time spent with people. I don't have to spend the full duration. I catch a vibe real quick. Speaking about Dougie Fresh, I heard you open up quite a few shows for yes, him. Yes, yes, yes. Um, Doug is a very interesting artist. I found out that Doug is the longest lasting in duration from the beginning of the episode of hip hop up until now, and he's still the busiest thing to a Doug Fresh. And is Dougie Fresh dad still managing you? Every day, every moment, every second. We just came off of a radio interview and we do mentoring. With our life experience, it, it becomes more than just music. So we end up in a mentoring situation where we help and share with the children and provide. And what do you love about the music? Business? What do I love about the music? I think that in such a small amount of time with music, you can say what it may take a president to already, and in the rotation you hear it over and over, you kind of got the people would sing a little bit and then keep on uh, allowing that to press upon their minds, especially if it's sens sensual or it makes a lot of sense. So I work within those two means between the emotional feel of it and then the super common sense of the music. Okay, are you traveling? And if you do, how far have you been in what country? Oh, man. Um, the traveling, I'd love to go. I, I do travel. We get show calls from here and there. We've been to Baltimore, to Boston. We've been to, um, we've been to the seas. We've been overseas. We've been to the cruises. This is some of the desires that we really like. The cruise lines because you get the international flavor. One song internationally is all you need. Mm -hmm. So an international flavor where somebody is really feeling your vocals internationally. You're feeling a void, a void of 
comparative thought, especially when it comes to someone like Teddy Pendergrass, who they are equating a sound in my voice to. And uh, one strike and the match is lit. So you have the audience, once you actually are giving them exactly what they paid for, and you, you hold on to that dream of theirs that they possess of who is this guy, so. And you keep on fulfilling that, you're a winner. So traveling, I love to do it. And we're in the midst of travel right now. We have some really, really big pants for the springtime. I just got finished working on the album and portions of the album. I got to give a shout out to um, Melvin Sparks, the Melvin Sparks, the great guitarist. He's all through the album. We just recently buried him and his energy can never be buried. So I ride with Melvin Sparks and plenty of other artists. Oh, uh, I've known Melvin Sparks, a very good friend of mine, and so I'm sorry about his passing. Okay, now let me ask you another question. When you travel, do you have a manager that goes with you? Just yes. how? Okay. I mean, they, without that, it's a little hectic. Now, I heard through the grapevines that you, you, mm -hmm. your record's doing so well mm -hmm. that they want you in Japan and Europe. Well, you know, the, the, the Japanese flight. It's a tight flight. I might have to get my own plane. We're going. Okay. So I have not only coming to Okinawa. We coming. Good. And could we hear a little something, something? Uh -huh. the audience here. DJ, I want to put something on for them. I want to know your name, know your type, and when the moon is right, the light, you can no longer be right there. Baby, come and share. My world have to go. So, oh, here comes your manager. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh -oh. Sometimes I do stuff on my own and get in trouble. Can you introduce it? To yes. She is, of her own, a great thinker, and of her own, a great wisdom. And, um, we want to say thank you to Nesta Felix for her guidance and leadership. Tell me a little bit about your statement. I, I ain't holding this paper for no reason. Yeah, all right. This is the front page of my running choir. We made the front page. When we did a release of our single, Crush, and it was my first and initial rendition to do a tape. And I think you're going to find out somebody in here you know. They call out Rachel Stanley. Oh, I know you don't have me in your paper. Oh, you don't have me in there. Oh, get I'm out of here. I'm about to expose her. Okay, that, that'll She's work. She's fully exposed. That'll work. And this is mine to you. That's how we get. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you, and sister. And you're such a gentleman. You always have been. Well, be careful that a gentleman is a rough And I side. would say how handsome you are, but I don't want to get in any trouble with anybody, but we on air, so that should be okay. You're fine. Okay. You're fine. Say handsome. That's the, name. All right. That's the name of the new album. That's the name of the new album. I want to okay. say that all, all people that walk, make sure that you walk straight. Make sure that you are a leader to all those who you may tap. Walk strong. So said so. Rock. All right. And this is R&R &R Records. The House of R and R Records, and my motto is, "You're only a step ladder to success." Mm. Bye bye. Hotel. I'd like to say thank you, Yvonne, for having us come through. And the music in here is crazy. The food is good. The talent is off the meter. I see them. I think we might have to do this.
This one is for me to tell you one more time with this tape. Yeah. Just to know 
into my mind when you're inside and shop, it's the hottest thing I've ever had in the longest time I've got. Oh, oh, I've got a crush on you.
this like Hammer said. Yeah. We've been together. Uh, yeah. Since 2000. Since that, yeah. And awesome. what's the name of your group? We are the Untouchables. Oh, you sound like you are. You Thank sound you. like you are. Thank you very much. Okay, uh, you're awesome. And this is r, &R Records, House of r, &R Records. And our motto is, you're only a Shout step ladder to yes. success. Bye-bye. Thank, <laughs> Thank you, guys.